Painted on the side of a Bay Area freeway shortly after the 9-11 attacks is gone tonight after Caltrans painted over it. The red, white, and blue stars and stripes had greeted drivers along Interstate 680 at the Sunol Gray between Sheridan and Vargas Roads. Now it's gray concrete again. KTVU's Lloyd LaQuesta has the story. He's along 680 now with a live report. Lloyd. Julie, Interstate 680 is one of the busiest freeways in the Bay Area as it passes through the, in and out the Silicon Valley. And every day for the last eight and a half years, motorists passing through the Sunol Grade had a chance to see a hillside mural on the Sunol Grade. It just uh, made me feel really patriotic, you know, just seeing it every day. Up until yesterday, motorists saw a 35-foot mural of the American flag painted on a concrete retaining wall. Today, it's just gray concrete painted over by Caltrans. It was put on the list, you know, for graffiti removal, and yesterday morning they painted over it with gray concrete paint. It should not be classified as graffiti. I mean, it was a well-done flag, and I felt like it's part of America. About a week after 9-11, Eric Noda was photographed roller painting the flag mural. It took three hours to finish. He and friends R.J. Waldron and Thomas Hanley picked the spot to express their patriotism after the terrorist attack. It's kind of like a, a landmark for me, um, and it reminds me of that day and the time um, yeah. in the wake of 9-11. But why did Caltrans wait so long to remove the flag? Maintenance wasn't aware that it was on the state right away. You know, it would have been removed sometime in the past. Regular 680 Sano commuters are upset. I don't know why they would consider it graffiti. I mean, we live in America. It should be a patriotic symbol. Everybody should enjoy it. Yeah, I drive this every day. Yeah, so, um, yeah, to not see it up there waving at me, I, you know, and even though it doesn't wave, it's still waving at you. The flag muralists say they plan to approach Caltrans for permission to repaint the flag in time for the 10th anniversary of 9-11. A Caltrans spokesman says they can apply through proper procedures for what they call transportation art. Live along Interstate 680, Lloyd LaQuesta, KTVU Channel 2 News.